Hello everyone, today we're taking a look at Wuhan, a DOS virus that I first took a look at about five years ago, but as usual I didn't do a very good job of explaining it. So we'll go ahead and run it, and now when it's present in memory it will infect all .com and .exe files as they are run, and as a directory listing command is issued. So if we do a dir w, there's a little bit of a pause as it infects the file. We'll take our old favorite graphics.com, you should all know it's 19,742, when we run it, it gets infected, comes back to the DOS prompt, we try to look at it again, another file gets infected, and then we can see that this file was also infected. Its size has increased to 23,033 bytes. See the same things with exe files. X copy, normally 16,930. We run X copy, gets infected, try to look at it, another file gets infected, and X copy has grown in size. Now this virus activates on June 24th of any year, after 11 a.m. So there's both a date and time requirement, because this virus is extra fancy. So we'll go ahead and change the date. And when we run any infected file, we might have to restart, but we'll see if it works. Nope, it works. Alright, so we get flashing message, warning, no reset. Your PC had been destroyed by me. Follow me and I can restore it for you. Today is my birthday. Say happy birthday to me. So if you don't have any friends in real life who can tell you happy birthday, then write your own virus and make everybody tell you it. Oh, better use all capital letters. And we'll hit enter. And it liked that. It gave us back to the DOS prompt here. Not der. What is happening? So I guess any command issued in infect files? Yep, it would appear so. So any command issue at all at the command prompt causes the virus to infect new files. And uh, so yeah, once you type happy birthday, it gives you control back. However, we'll see if yep, running any file again, infected or not, causes it to go right back into the virus. So if we try to say, no, I don't want to tell you. Oh, uh, if you say you are a bitch and say enter. And get why, like, why did you break up with me, or why are you such an asshole? I just wanted you to say happy birthday. And when you do this, uh, probably should have done that. Because if we reset, we will see that Wuhan has sort of uh, overwritten everything on your hard drive. Yeah, with junk, so uh, your computer doesn't work anymore. So all your data's gone, partition sector is wrecked. It's pretty much got to restore from backups. So it copies all that data into RAM where you run it, and when the payload strikes, if you type happy birthday, it'll rewrite that all back to the disk so you can keep on using your computer. But if you tell it to go to hell or you are a bitch, it doesn't really work that way. So that is about it for Wuhan. Pretty destructive, but only if you're an asshole to the virus author. So remember, you gotta be nice to those nerds, you'll never know when they'll just come to mess up your computer. Alright, that's about it. Thanks for watching.